you right guys, it's Capcom Tom here and welcome to another FIFA News Flash. It's time for Team of the Week and it is Team of the Week number 6. Now it's happened, we all knew it was probably coming sooner or later, but Ibrahimovic has gone and bagged himself in inform. And it looks like Path to Paris is probably going to take the best part of the rest of the year to finish because he's going to be well over 2 million coins I would expect his normal cards going for over a million hopefully that will actually drop the price of his regular card but we'll talk about that more in a sec now if you're looking to buy some ultimate team coins maybe to open packs or buy some players whatever go check out battle.com their link will be down in the description a fast cheap and very reliable coin service and if you use the discount code teamcapgovern you'll get 5% off all of your purchases so there you go you can see the team of the week Looks beastly. Obviously, Ibrahimovic up front. We have a quick look at him. He's obviously got five-star skills. He's got 77 pace, 92 shooting, 80 passing, 90 dribbling, and 81 heading, as well as 55 defending. So, he's going to be an absolutely fantastic player. But, as I said, he's going to really, really make it very difficult for me to complete the Path to Paris series. I don't know what I'm going to do with him. Um, maybe if I get lucky when I do some packs on my main account, if I pack him, then I'll move him across because I don't really want to have to trade to all the way to him. And hopefully, as I said, it will actually reduce the price of his regular card because obviously, you know, people are going to not want to spend, I don't know, three, four million on this card. They'll want to spend a max of maybe two and that may force the price of his normal card down, but we'll have to wait and see. We also have from Fiorentina Rossi, who I believe is currently top scorer in Serie A. We also have Meza Ozil. His inform was pretty much... Um, well, it was always going to come. He's been playing fantastically for Arsenal. 77 pace, 77 shooting, 87 passing, 89 dribbling. And uh, looks like a very good player. We have Inform Hazard. 88 pace, 82 shooting, 86 passing, and 80 or 90 dribbling. That's going to be a very, very decent card. And I can imagine that going for probably around the four 500k mark. We then have Schneider from Galatasaray. He gets an inform. He has 89 passing, being his best stat, as well as 85 dribbling and 81 shooting. We have Pranic from Roma. He has 70 pace and 78 shooting. That's not too bad as a centimetre, especially since he has 84 passing and 83 dribbling. We then have K Kigari. And uh, he looks like a half-decent player, but he'll probably be going for this card just because his stats aren't all that amazing. Although he does have 88 passing, which is kind of crazy. We have uh, Sore at left back from Lille and looks like a pretty average silver player. We also have Dianne from the Bundesliga. I believe he's in the Bundesliga anyway, but he has 75 pace. So he's actually quite a quick uh, defender in the Bundesliga. So he may be one that people want to pick up. We also have Arribas from uh, La Liga. We have Ospina, who is the, well, he's already, I believe, the best Colombian goalkeeper, and now he's got an inform, so that's obviously the best one that you can get. And if we look at the silvers, you can see that there is a silver goalkeeper called Bizot, who's from uh, Netherlands. We also have Miguel Vitor, he's a centre-back, he has good defensive stats, but, you know, his pace is going to let him down a little bit. We have Campbell, an 84 pace right mid, and he looks like he might be half decent. We also have Klitsch, a Polish centre-mid, and he has decent passing of 80, also 71 dribbling is pretty good we have Destorma as well he is a Belgian and he has 71 shooting as well as 64 dribbling and 67 passing we also have Abdaloué and uh, he actually looks like a very good player I mean 77 pace 75 shooting 72 dribbling and 68 heading those are some good all round stats and then our final player for this team of the week is Santini a uh, Croatian striker and uh, he looks pretty average, to be honest. His stats aren't all that incredible, although he does have 73 heading and 73 shooting. So there you go, guys. That is Team of the Week. Um, what do you think I should do about the Inform Ebra? Do we just keep going with the series as we uh, as we are at the moment, or do we do something about it? Maybe we uh, load up our Microsoft or our account with uh, Microsoft points, and we open some packs, see if we can pull one, and uh, obviously we get some coins from the other players that we're going to pull as well, which will help us on the series. But yeah, put your suggestions down in the comment section. Drop a like if you could. That'd be amazing. Subscribe if you're new and I will see you all next time.